Okay, in previous video we have implemented process room in relation right or left. In this video we will create the same but for up or down. And we will create a method get valid x for neighbors left uh, up and down. So those two methods will be created. Uh, so let's start. So here we will have almost the same code as the above, but we will take note bottom structure. equals null list of node the structure below children or structure bottom children equals structure helper dot traverse and pass structure one and node the top structure equals null and list node structure above children equals structure helper traverse structure to okay so var sorted bottom structure equals the structure below or structure bottom children order by descending child such as child dot top right area corner dot y and to list okay and now if our if our sorted Okay, let's change the name. If our sorted bottom structure dot count equals one, we will set bottom structure equals structure bottom children zero. And else we will call int max y this time equals sorted uh, structure. Uh, bottom structure uh, zero dot top left area corner dot y and sorted bottom structure equals sorted bottom structure where and we call child and math math f dot abs and max y subtract um, ch uh, child a uh, top left area corner dot y is less than 10 to list so we do exactly the same we choose only the uh, rooms that are close to the maximum y value and next we will create index uh, the index equals unity engine dot random dot range and we will sort for uh, choose by zero and sorted bottom structures dot count and we will set bottom the structure equals sorted structure bottom structure dot index or uh, index uh, position okay and next we did the same with the possible neighbors in top structure equals the structure above children dot where and child such as get valid x for neighbor up down okay and here we will pass bottom structure dot top left area corner bottom structure top right area corner child bottom left area corner 
child uh, bottom right area corner and we will check if this is different than minus one okay and now we will order call on it order by and child touch as child bottom Okay, we cannot use child here. Uh, we should. Such as child dot bottom right structure. Okay, I think we should first uh, get rid of this error. Okay, and here now we can use to bottom right area corner dot y and to list okay great and again we need to check if possible neighbors dot count equals zero then we set to the top structure equal structure two and else top structure equals possible neighbors in top structure zero and int x equals get valid x for neighbors and here we will pass bottom structure actually we can call we can copy this uh, from here okay and simply here we'll pass the top structure instead okay should be good and we don't want the animation clip info we want to have int value great and now we will check while x is equal to minus one and sorted bottom structures that count is greater than one so here we call sorted bottom uh, structures equals sorted bottom structures where our child uh, such as child top left area corner dot x is different than top structure dot top left area corner dot x to list to delete this value from our sorted list and uh, we call bottom structure equals sorted structures zero and again calculate the x and at the end we need to preset our bottom left area corner equals new vector to int x and bottom structure uh, bottom the structure dot top left area corner dot y and top right area corner equals new vector to int x plus this dot with the corridor width and our top structure dot bottom left area corner dot y okay and what left what's left is our uh, get valid uh, neighbor up down and we need to delete this int before x because we have x already defined so let's find this method here it is so first what we need to do is rename those variables so let's call them first will be bottom node left second will be bottom node right Uh, the third third one will be top node left and the second one will be top node right okay and we need those if statements so if our top 
node left dot x is less less than bottom node left dot x and bottom node right dot x is less than top node uh, right dot x another one will be if top node uh, left dot x is greater than or equal to bottom node left dot x and bottom node right dot x is greater than or equal to top node right dot x another one will be if bottom node left dot x is greater or equal to top node left dot x and bottom node left dot x is smaller or equal to top node right dot x and last check will be if bottom node right dot x is less or equal to top node right dot x and bottom node right dot x is greater or equal than top node right uh, dot uh, top node left dot x okay and at the end we'll return minus one okay and again we will call in each of those return the structure the structure helper dot calculate middle point and we will pass x value this time for this calculation and we will call bottom node left in the first example plus new vector to int modifier distance as the first parameter zero as the second and the bottom node right minus new vector to int and this corridor with plus modified distance and the second parameter will be zero okay we can copy this now why is it what is wrong with it i yeah we have no line ending great let's copy this first delete the values and then copy them again okay great and here in the second from the top we will pass top node left plus new vector to int modified distance and zero and as the second parameter will be top uh, node right minus new vector to int well, not minus equals not equal minus but just minus okay this dot corridor width plus modifier distance and zero as a second parameter okay the third one we will need to call bottom node left plus new vector to int and modifier uh, value and zero and the second will be top node right minus new vector to int this dot corridor plus modifier value and zero okay and last one we'll pass our top node left plus new vector to int modifier distance and zero and as the second parameter we will pass bottom node and right minus new vector to int our this dot corridor with plus modifier and zero as the second parameter closed brace so i have checked this and it looks all good so believe it or not we have finally finished implementing our corridor node so now in the next video we will visualize our results on our uh, 
screen by creating corridors as well as rooms. So see you in the next video.